Good day, friends. My name is Ruto, and welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to more of The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. I don't know what the hell is happening right now. It seems like there's cats shitting or vomiting or whatever around. Um, okay. Let's see. The volunteer, look around the area. What the hell am I. What did I activate? I have no idea. <laughs> We're doing stuff. We met with uh, Lambert in the last episode, actually. That's his name, right? Um. Let's go to the western gate. Damn, the weather is just awful. Wait, which way should I go? Because I don't want to go into the city. For now, at least. Um, okay. Let's cross the bridge. Did that guard or whatever call me a rock? I guess I'm a rock today. Ha ha. Anyway, uh, the sun, I can't see where it's so realistic as I cannot see where I'm going. Whoop, whoop. Okay, almost. Now I have to meditate, that's for sure. Um, I'll do 5 a.m. Why not? Ooh, what's that? Beggar took something else because I didn't read. Hand fiber. I see something else I might be able to pick. Wolf's bane. I guess I'll just swim over there. I'm sure there's a boat somewhere nearby, but... Okay. Another truth. Camp army. No cross, no boat steer. Redanian army? Where are you hiding them? In, in here. Me. No seamans. Join me, King Rabotid army. Order got guard boats. Is. Hmm. Boats are in pretty bad shape. Me. Guard boats, Red say, but no wood for to make a fence. Their boats, I, so me, fence, make a boat. Boats, guard boats. Very logical. Why'd you join the army? Someone recruit you? Crude? No crude. Come good soldier man, say charge man. Woods boats. Peasanters, they steals peasanters' boats. That's the trouble, don't know. Think I do. Redanian seized some peasants' boats. Thought the peasants might try to take them back. What happened next? Chargy men go. Soldier men drink and sing. Not sing. Listen, troll. Both. Come, peasanters, swing sharpie sticks. I help one army. Runner to runner. Holler, peasanters. Holler, soldier mans. Gentle. Move them apart. But all light down, soldier mans too. But order had me watch boats. And watch I. Trollalolo soldier man now, Trollalolo just sing too. You for sing you? No thanks, heard you earlier. 
But listen, where are the bodies? Don't see any. Hungry though. Should no waste. Peasant as good food. Soldier man friends. Not so good big stew. Always good. I mean, I don't. I feel like if I say eating soldiers makes you dangerous, I will have to attack him and kill him. And I don't want to do that. I kind of like him. He's kind of cute in a weird, awful way. Guess I understand. Wartime rules. Man's soldier man too? Uh, no. Tra -la -la -la. Makes man's soldier man. Tra -la. Charge man. Say, green paint. And man brings paint. Uh, paint? What are we talking about? Yeah. Paint! Paint! Red colory? White colory? City gods? No city go. Trololo. What boats? Sure, I'll bring you some paint. Fine. I'll try to find some paint for you. Good man's. Redaini army. No service forget. Oh, that's the stew from the people, I'm assuming. Oh. oh this I guess this move that bad. It kind of looks like a loot box. Oh, there's a fast shot. Oh, let's see. And we're in the harbor. There's some kind of plant here, but I won't go there. Let's get the paint for the troll. I thought I would. I never thought I would say that, but. Um, I should actually fix my stuff as well since I'm here. So don't think I did that. Recently, at least. Everyone to me! To me! The merchant or this merchant? I have no idea. What can I do you for? If I ain't got it today, say the word and I'll have it tomorrow. I like your head just then. Um, let's see. Let me see. Might pick something. What does he have? Torch? Oh, he does have paints. Only 16 crowns, huh? Sure. Various pelts and furs. Oh, by the way, do I have junk that I can sell? Huh? Roach, quest items, other alchemy. Yeah, I think it's the quest, quest, quest. This could be sold or crafting of them. Hmm. But it's cheap. I won't look at them right now. Too tedious. <laughs> so long. Now quickly to the smith. Is this not a door? How the hell do you enter this house? <laughs> Winds howling. Oh, this door. That I don't know how the hell. <laughs> a few moments later. Okay, I sold my items. I do wonder. Where's the nearest stash? Doesn't show me. Knocks and print at least, so I guess I don't have one here. Um. Oh, check it out later. Let's quickly go back to the troll. There is some kind of, I'm assuming, side quest at Kajir's Quarry or whatever it's called. There was an exclamation mark on the map. Why are you so ready to fight? <laughs> so I might have to check that out later. I literally spawned on top of him, basically. Private Slate, report on order. Just so happens I have some paint on me. Oh! Oh! Uh-oh. What? What's the matter? Has paid, but how? Dunno. Hmm. 
might be a problem. Man's how no. I order. Man's does. I guess I do. Depends what. Birdo cutlery. Redania Birdo. Shields like. I guess I could try and hopefully he won't be mad guess if I, I can fail. Give it a shot. Got a brush? Beautiful. Pretty Birdo. Think so? As long as you're happy with it. <laughs> Like man's a five-year-old, but I love it. No, that other man take juice. What a pretty, pretty horsey when man falls dead. Oh, I got the diagram. Oh, no. Excellent gauntlets. Hmm. Yeah. Nice. Let's see. What else do we have? Favor for a friend. Following the thread, go to Karo and look for Hammond. No defense and no god. The gangs of Novigrad. Haunted house, let's do this. Okay, f you know what? I'll go here near the stash. I'll mark the stash. Just to leave, you know, the weapons that I'm not using there. Oh god, a lot of goat hides. Scrub before I lose and deer hides. Nice. Okay, let me quickly do this. Okay, I put the unique ones in there. Because there's, there's other weapons that I'll... Eventually sell, I guess. Once I remember to do that, because like I've been to a few merchants right now and I did not do it. <laughs> anyway, let's see what the hell's happening. Oh, it's this house where the godling was doing stuff. Ow, don't pull. Well, you wanted braids, but I didn't want my hair pulled. Can't have one without the other. Then I don't want them. Upstairs or downstairs? Some, uh, what's happening? Oh, Sarah. And Tilly? Green Tilly? What the hell are they? Witcher? Witcher? Green, look who's come. Huh. Live here together now? Didn't know. Once you told me Sarah had been responsible for my nightmares, I decided to see if the devil's as scary as they paint him, or her. I came in to find not a fiend, but our little Sarah. And I can't say why, but we took a liking to one another immediately. Long ago, to isolate themselves from a world of beasts, humans began building cities. But since beasts prowl within stone walls as well as they do outside them, this did not allay human fears. The truth is, walls guarantee no one's safety. The place where you lock yourself in and lock all else out, that's not your home. Your home is sometimes a place you travel long and far to find. Okay. Uh, that's all? Hey. Uh, what, uh, why did you push me? <laughs> Jeez. I thought something might- oh god, why do I always fall off those stairs? I actually thought something, you know, happened here. I thought I would have to fight something. Well, it's good that they're keeping each other company, you know? Seems like they have a mother-daughter relationship, kind of. Good for them. Let's see, do I have any contracts? Um, I could do an elusive thief, go to the marketplace during the day and dock to Sylvester Amello. Okay, it's nearby. Save first. I want to clear out the ones that I can clear out before going forward to the main story, I guess, you know? A shady yeah. teacher. No. Oh, fuck. I'm right now. His voice. Ooh. Bye -bye tomorrow. It's like gravel. Greetings, master. Hear about the contract. Really got an imp problem? Or is that just an imperfection in the notice? You ought not jest, Master Witcher. 
I know the creatures are only to exist in fairy tales, yet I saw one with my own eyes as it stole from my stall. All right. So what's this imp look like? Like a mean, fat cat, but a very large one. Uh, this tall, see? And it walked upon its hind paws. What did it swipe from you? Once it was bread, uh, then a fish, then apples. It might not seem like much, but add it together and the business suffers. And I'm hardly alone in being pestered. It's nicked something from every stand in the square. So, will you teach it a lesson with your silver sword? Maybe, but like... Is that Sarah doing this? Crystal's chair. Make it worth my while and I will. Demand for witches is high, supplies low. I pick and choose my contracts these days. Haggling. To haggle for a high reward, choose an amount using uh, the left stick and confirm your choice by pressing X. If your counterpart accepts your offer, you've made a deal. If your offer is too high, your counterpart will grow annoyed. Push too hard, then he will break off negotiate. Oh. Let's see. He's offering 243 right now, huh? Let's try. I'll try it. The 300. That's probably too much. A bit much, but a compromise is in sight. Oh? What about. 280? A bit much, but a compromise is in sight. 270? Fine negotiation on your part, Master. So be it. We'll call it agreed. I'll do it. Relax. I'll help you. Small businesses are the foundation of a healthy economy, and so on and so on. Thank you, Master Witcher. I don't know if this will be of use, but most recently the thief leapt over that wall and ran into a passageway. It was the last I saw of him and a few of my wares. Okay, follow the imp using your witcher senses. In body and soul. Oh, those are big feet. Merchant was right. Actually does look like a giant cat. Can I... Oop. Oh? But I mean... Oh, oh. No bread, no coin, poor as shite. Um... Was that poop? Looks like the imp dropped some loot. <laughs> I mean, I was running away. Definitely came through here. He can climb walls, it seems. Whatever that thing is. Drop down into the moat. Trail ends here. Guess I'm dropping down there too. Okay, see more footprints. Doors wide open. Interesting. Oh, I see some kind of leather or something. Which I can't activate. Oh, oh. Letter? Well, well. Our imps at least literate, if not outright educated. Let's see. Jan, please, cut out this nonsense of the ones. This might come to you as a surprise, but the giant cat will tend to stick in people's memory. Why don't you pick some other safer farm like I did? I've been walking around as a beggar for three years now, and no one's better than I. And such earnings. You wouldn't need to steal anymore, so how will it be? If you decide on it, I'll put in a word for you with the king of beggars. Till our next riding, Louis. P.S. Burn this letter once you've read it, alright? P.P.S. Yes, yes, I know, I'm paranoid, but humor me and burn it. P.P.P.S. <laughs> if I find this letter next time I come see you, you owe me a beer. Well. A Doppler. Explains a lot. And complicates matters. Need a good lead to track him down. Well, let's see what we can find. Bread. I will steal its food, though, because like, I'm an awful person, I know. 
I guess let's check out the second floor. Some kind of clothing is nearby. Crystallized essences. And Who keeps beer and freaking chests? I still can't. Once shall become up to Mary, I will not be reading that now. Oh god. What a wild hunt. Woman's blouse, a man's shirt, a child's shoes, but only one bed. Lavender, strong scent. Enough to track him down. Oh. Over here somewhere. Which one of them is the Doppler, though? Um, this one, maybe. If Cheers anything happened to you, we'd go hungry. And the wages are too bleeding large. What? And when I walk down the street, I'm only ever I'm assuming no, it's the, the temple guard, right? Rare sight. An elf and a guard of the Eternal Fire having a friendly chat. Friendly? Nothing further from the truth. This racist here has demanded to search me for no reason at all. You's a non-human. I need no other reason. Lucky I didn't find anything on you. Now piss off to the woods. Go play your flute. You are a terrible actor. That was some pretty bad acting. Really ought to explore other career options. Petty theft, maybe. You dare insult an officer on duty? Let me give you some advice, mutant. Look who's talking. I know you're a Doppler and a kleptomaniac. Merchants put out a contract on me. <sighs> Always the same old shit. Could have talked. Maybe I would have kept you alive. Now we might have to kill you. I don't know. Hey, wait. My brother stayed in Samaria. Ain't no hope for him, is he? I thought I wouldn't be able to grab him, to be honest. So. Really want to see an angry witcher. Do you? Damn, I look old. <laughs> well, you don't have powers. He can use my powers? Well, at least you're weak as hell. Come on. Aha. Please, stop. I surrender. <laughs> so weird. Might be scary. able to look like a witcher, but that won't make you fight like one. You're donning your skins enough to know what kind of man you are, what you feel. Oh. I don't kill him, true. But then not everybody applies my rules, and not everyone's got my conscience. So start stealing somewhere else. Far from Novigrad, preferably. Golden Age of Dopplers ended here a while ago. I know. But I thought they'd not catch me. I thought myself too smart. Serves me right. Might have learned this lesson the hard way. Time to go. Somewhere far away. But first, take this. As a token of my gratitude. So long, Witcher. Probably won't get my full reward though from the merchant. Maybe. What did he give me though? Besides experience points. Oh, crowns, 215. Not bad though. Diagram Gnomish here. Is that a weapon? Is that an armor piece? I have no idea. What an. Dwarvish or whatever. Gnomish Gwihir <laughs> is. I am back. Now give me my money. Greetings, master. Problem solved. Convinced the imp to go back to the countryside to tangle horse manes and piss in milk, as tradition ordains. And how would I know you speak the truth? No trophy, no reward. 
There better be one. Or you'll feel the invisible hand of the market smack you so hard you won't be able to sit down for a week. I'll give you half the agreed sum, no more. And I'll not do business with you again. Oh, shut up. I got more, I think. With you two combined. I got a trophy as well. 135, I'm not bad, I guess, you know. Um, let's see. What else do we have? Technically, I could try Deadly Delights. You know what? Sure. Talk to the guard. Might as well try, you know. I'm almost at level 15, so I should be able to do it, unless it's some kind of weird ass monster that's super strong. Somebody's puking over there. Ah. Like the people here have no oh. I've had enough no breaks whatsoever. Like they just vomit on the street, that. lay around, cough in your face, you know. No restraints. Oh hello, mister. Your helmet is interesting. Hmm? I'm here about the contract. Oh, well, a night patrol got massacred. Tough men, the lot, armed to the teeth. A beast must be. Must? What makes you say that? If you've seen the corpses. Well, let's ask them. What did the corpses look like? I've not seen anything like it in my life, and I've seen a lot of corpses. Ever heard talk of folk who died in the deserts of Zeracania? From the heat alone, these corpses no, came straight out of those tales. Okay. Let's talk about my pay first. I know what my services are worth. Okay, let's try. Let's try to seventy. All right. Okay. I believe I can pay you that, provided, of course, that you do well. Okay. Bodies buried yet? Where? Orders were to burn him. Our medic was to take a look first. Talk to him. He's at the docks now. Okay. See what I can do. We'll pay you. The boys and me, we pulled what we had for a reward. Oh, you do? I thought somebody from higher up, you know, would do that, but... I guess they have to... Okay. Let's try talking to the medic then. See what he will tell us. Black ones, the Danians. Okay, he's somewhere over here. You're the medic. What can I help you with? I'm looking into the dead guards. Heard you did autopsies. Did their friends hire you? Good. I'm happy to help. Find any claw or fang marks on the bodies? Fangs? No. Claws? Not quite. Only scratches. Fingernails, most likely. From their adventures with whores. Right. Last body. Where was it found? In a side alley along the road from the docks to the brothel district. Someone had dropped it there in the middle of the night. Uh -huh. Need to examine that spot. Heard the bodies were desiccated. Do you believe a beast killed them? I don't. The bodies were dried out. But perhaps they tried to apprehend a mage who cast a nasty spell on them. Was it dehydration? Strictly speaking, no. Though I don't quite know what to compare it to. Thanks. Should go see the place where they were found. Good luck. Did a vampire do this? Maybe their blood's been sick that I don't know, to be honest, but like something similar? We'll see, I guess. Once we actually find the monster. Or whatever. By the way. I wish there was a quick save button. I'm assuming on the PC version there is, but like, it would be so nice <laughs> to have that. 
What's here? Oh god, I'm sorry. Jeez. Bodies were found here. Gotta look for clues. Anything unusual. Oh. Well, there's a lot of footprints. A child's footprints. Damn. Lots of foot traffic. Horse? Hoofprints, clearly. A horse? Hmm. No horse I know walks on two legs. Oh. Closer. Don't be shy. You'll find I've everything you could ever need. No, no, I'm looking for something that might kill you because you were standing in the wrong place. Uh huh. Oh, think he's punishable by death. Oh, shit. Over here. Not on the back, Gerald. Evidence all points to crippled Kate's. What's over there? Empty perfume vial. Expensive. Neighborhood's a bit shabby for this. You know, let's talk to the owner of the brothel. Oh, I have to enter through the other way, huh? Whoop. Don't tell me there will be a lot of naked people in here, probably. Madam. You don't look like the owner. Greetings. <laughs> oh, here it is. The apocalypse. A witch has walked into my brothel. What's strange about that? What's strange is you. Everyone knows witches are freaks, mutants, unnatural. And this here is a decent brothel for whores with principles. Well, spit it out. Got all the same bits in your trousers like a normal lad. Last I checked, everything was where it should be. Heard about the murders? Guardsmen? Many perish round here. It's the pleasure kills them. Right. Tell the truth. The succubus. It draws customers. It's raised our taking something wonderful. I know it's a threat, but I don't know that it kills. A succubus. Where'll I find it? I've placed it in a house nearby. Here's the key. This dumb bitch. I'm sorry, I can't. I I mean I understand she's making a lot of money that way, but like yo. You shouldn't be doing that. <laughs> Confront the second. Don't tell me it'll try. You know. Let me check my glossary. What would it be? Oh, higher a higher vampire looks like a human, huh? Mar. That was new. Goblin is new. No, necrophages. No, although they're very ugly. I'm assuming not an insectoid. I have nothing about them, do I? I mean, maybe she called it a succubus. Maybe it's something completely different, you know? Yes, we'll soon find out, won't we? Let's see. I have the key. Why does it say this? Or do I have to? Um, is there another way I could enter this? Because <laughs> it's not letting me. Oh, there's stairs. Okay. You're the succubus. Who are you? Never heard of witchers. Have you come to kill me? Maybe. But first let's talk. Because <laughs> I try to avoid that if I can. Want to talk first. Why do you kill those guards? I was careless. Let them surprise me. They wished to kill me. I had to defend myself. That it? No heart-rending story about human hatred for all things different, all things strange. I'm not one to lie, nor do I kill without reason. 
I guess I'll spare her. Maybe. You gotta leave the city. And what if I don't? I'll have to kill you. I despise change. How stupid of me to walk into an ambush, let myself be surprised. I'll have to lie about killing you. Usually I bring a trophy. Very well, take this. And this, because I'm furious with you. Though I shall calm down once I'm away from this place. You should be happy. Aaron died. Why don't you give me a sword? And it's better than what I have. Nice! Oh, and it looks beautiful. Oh, I'm glad I actually spared her. Look all pretty suspicious to me. Like, coin is nice, but ha getting unique weapons like this is even nicer. These me of doubt, of anguish, fear. They ought to never let your kind okay. in. I mean, she gave me something, so hopefully we'll be able to prove to this guy. Maybe. Hmm? Guards were killed by a succubus. Su succubus? In Novigrad? How? Light of the eternal fire protects the city. It's shitty. Must have gone out a few times recently. Anyway, succubus won't harm anyone anymore. Here's proof. Masterful work, Witcher. And here's your reward, as promised. Farewell. I never would have skill. No, I won't do that right now. Did he give me the full sum? Yes. Now, I think I did all of the contracts that I can for now. Although there is quite a few notice boards that might have new ones. But let's activate... Huh. Soothsayer. Gangs of Novigrad, let's do that. There's so many shady individuals here. Elvin blood, eh? What? Hello? Um they're probably going to be mad that I came here. I don't know. What you doing? A wee minute, Witcher. Okay. Now, I'm curious something mighty. How is it you were off the same bloody night horse and tried to kill me? It was chance, honest. I was at the brothel. I've witnesses. I don't doubt you found some witnesses, but I do doubt the bit about chance. Know what? Shite conversation, this. So much blethering, we've got nowhere. Don't tell me he's going to. Lad, you have a chat with him. It's simple. I want to know where all son is. Um, I thought he was going to crush us, you know. I've not crush us bits you. with that not ever. No! No! I know nothing! Imagine if he actually doesn't know anything. <laughs> They're just going to kill him, probably. But he probably knows something. Maybe. Help me find Junior. I'm about to send my lads around Horson's hideouts. Won't say no to a witch's blade. Leave my men, take the water Junior, and drag him out of his hidey hole. Win win situation, as I see it. Horson can't die until I've talked to him. My lads are hot headed and I like them like that. Want to rein them in? Do so on your own. I might have to kill them though. All right. Now, I suspect Junior's hiding at his casino in Gildorf. Either that or near the arena beneath the bits. My lads will be there. Find him. Okay. Casino and the arena. Okay. I guess we're going to look for. Forsen Jr. That's a name. That's. Just... <laughs> oh, an alchemist! I 
I feel like 9 p.m. is the perfect time for him to be at one of these places, you know. No, no, no. Oh, grilled pork. Awesome. I took it from his pocket, probably. Uh, you, you imagine just having that in your pocket and then eating it later? <laughs> what is happening to that child? What happened, kid? They. Oh, I guess they killed your parents. Hey, wait. Oh, they're going to attack me, right? They the great gets. Grab him. I really think you'll survive. Well, where's the child now, huh? Take care of yourself. <laughs> oh. Okay. They're just as clowns, huh? Oh, fuck. Come right. Ready? Right, oh. We go on your mark. Let's go then. Hello. Uh, hi. I thought he was a friend. <laughs> Why did I think he, he wasn't an enemy? I just like setting people on fire, and that's probably awful. Oh! I'm assuming he's not here. A mind's like war. Never know when you're done. I'll drink one potion to heal up a little bit. Let's dance. Come on, quickly, kill him. Oop! <laughs> List of dithers. Can I read it? Adalbert Zimmer, Gwyn Huis, Lettuce Billy, Sigamar Prokop, Rico with a exclamation mark, so he's important probably. Mortimer Schwindel, Stan de Gris, and Artwork, Vander Baltimore, those names. Beat you half to death. Hey, can oh, you you're hear me? Rico. Hello. Um, what the hell are you? He's some guy. Is he a dwarf? I didn't notice. <laughs> you alive? Oh, finish me. Don't intend to. Who the hell are you? I heard screaming downstairs. It's all right now. Will you help me? Maybe. You're not hurt all that bad. Let's talk first. Why are you here? Uh, what's it look like? I came here to sit and think. Does it look like I want to hear jokes? All right. Clever and tough's not working for me. They took me for one of Bedlam's moles. Are you? Well, kinda, yeah. So what have you kinda learned? Horson's working hand in glove with the Redanians. I don't know the details, but he's on their side. And that's all I know. I guess I'll let him run. Take care of yourself. Thanks. I don't know. I'll lay low until things settle down. Bedlam will learn you help me. See ya. He's sure to reward you. 
Wonder if Dijkstra knows Junior's made a deal with the Redanians. Maybe. If he doesn't, that will be a surprise for him, I guess, kind of. You make definitely make him angry. <laughs> Princess Zithia's sword? The hell is that? Inventory, let's see. Not as good as a steel sword, damn it. <laughs> it would be nice to. Xenthias, not Zithias, but it looks cool, I think. Who is Princess Xenthia, though? This is my question. Um, should I talk to you, Hench Dwarf? You're a fucking dunk leech! You too. If you see in the dark, and your study, make a fine road sniffer if you let us with all. Get a Lared! Witcher! Let's see. Guess we're going to the arena now? Fucking hi, Oz! I thought they would attack me, to be honest. You heard. No passing. Maybe I can persuade them. Greetings. Don't know you. Not letting you in. And don't you fucking stand there. I want my chance in the arena. Come in. Who's in charge? Igor. I call him Hook. That woman just appeared out of Bloody nowhere. <laughs> Out of sudden sincerity. Down a corridor, then left. Come on, get ready. Your turn now. I am ready. I don't know who yeah. you're looking for. No, but you won't. Huh? Oh, oh god. Yeah. Watch me accidentally yeah. start a fight. Switch this sword for a rusty one. You need to hold on for Which one of you is Igor? I'm assuming There's the one on the throne. I need work. What can you do? Good with a sword. Wouldn't scoff at working as protection. And who here would you protect? Crowds can spin out of control. Somebody's got to keep the peace. Hmm. Claim any kind of experience? Monsters, I guess? I'm a witcher. I kill monsters for coin. Been doing it all my life. Humans won't be a problem. A guard must fight sometimes, but that's not most important. The essential question is, can you control yourself? And can you control a crowd? Been taught how to slow down or speed up my heart rate, how to dilate my pupils and alter my metabolism. My medallion vibrates when danger's near, and I know a few simple spells. Hmm, I'll have to test you. I want to see how you manage in a fight, if you can fight at all. You shall fight in the arena. Survive three bouts, and I'll put you to work. Okay. Set me up. Should be easy. Already have. Shall we start right away, or do you need time to prepare? I think I'm good to go. Always prepared. Excellent. Let's see what you're worth. Remember, you fight to the death. The crowd doesn't take kindly to those who spare their foes. Let's do this. Let me guess, they'll give me an option Ready to spare someone. Purses. Probably the Bidding last person or whatever. From the far east, where a man's life is worth less than a cup of water. A witcher! A murderous mutant! His opponent, Gustav Rohn! A man who cut his way out of his mother's womb with a knife! As ever, a fight oh, no. to the no. death! Kids, I will not kill him. Whoa! I wanted to kill him. Release I... the hounds.
Born brawlers in battle! A fracas! A rumpus! A fray! The Witcher versus the Hairy Brothers! Straight from brothers. the Wild Isles of Skellige! Sired by a mountain bear! They live to the Witcher and Gustav Rowan defeat their opponents! Next fight! The Witcher doing what he does best! Face Monster. to face with beasts! I wanted to use Quinn. A wither! Oh god. Come on, Gustav, help me. Can I loot it? Oh man. Well, I did it. Why are they booing me? <sighs> and they got. Oh god. God, how I hate these friends, they're so rude. Gustav, don't die, please. We've just met, but you're a friend. Please tell me that's all, because like that's a lot of enemies I had to fight to prove myself, goddammit. That hell is Boris. Shall I release Boris? Boris! A troll? I feel like that will be a troll. Especially for you, for the first time in a long time. Release Boris. Was I right? <laughs> of course, he's a bear with such a Russian name. I feel bad for killing Boris, though. Aww. I'll take it. Yet step. another win for the Witcher. Is Bravo. that Worson? Plowing scrag them furrow. They tell me a true bruise had come to the arena. Would you believe it? They were right. You're an ugly one. Thanks. Cyprian Wiley, known to most as Horson Jr., appreciates good handiwork. Well, we've not had enough. Now, Cleaver's dwarves are in the sewers. They've slaughtered the guards. Don't stand here like a sodden prick at a wedding. Master the men and get out those midgets. And would someone please? Don't. Kill the blasted witcher! Ah, that's how it's going to be, huh? You heard the man! Kill him! Oh, Gustav. It's been nice knowing you. I thought Gustav betrayed me for a second there. Wait a second. Die, Igor, you will not. He killed Gustav. Oh Should my god. Poor Gustav. I feel bad. I wanted for Gustav to stay alive. I. <laughs> I was rooting for him. I lost my only friend today. So sad. Definitely. Out of potions, but I should still do good against people. How do I?
because they went the wrong way. Gold ring, message from Igor too. Messages from Igor. Since there's been some misunderstanding lately about the valuables and a bit of blood's been split for no plowing reason whatsoever, I'd like to reassure you all the coin is safe and sound in the lockbox. The blind asshole who thought it was missing was looking in the wrong place. Walk down the corridor leading from the upper level towards the arena, turn so your backs to the grating and look for and look to the wall opposite you. If you've eyes to see, you'll find what you're looking for. Let me emphasize that Horson's Jr.'s crowns have not been touched. Not a single copy is missing, I swear on my own handsome head. That they're secure and waiting to be picked up, Igor. Well, his head is definitely not handsome. That is a lie. If I've ever heard one, I could sit down here, maybe. Let's see. Maybe I maybe could do something with it. How do I go down? Another way, maybe. Oh, there we go. Floor is worn by a moving door. Something behind this wall. Interesting. Interesting. The time I accidentally closed it. Okay. So what do we have in here? Vials. Sheepskin, water, vial. Axman's gauntlets. Of course, hide. Mysterious leather and some crowns. Not a lot of them, though. Mysterious leather to Horson Jr. King Radovid is unhappy with your performance. You were to rid the city of the other members of the so-called Big Four. Yet not only do they still live, but they also know of your role in the attempted assassination. That was not our arrangement. For the time being, hide in the place which the messenger delivering this missive will indicate to you and stay out of sight. His Majesty lives in the hope that mutual animosity between the other members of the Big Four will finish the job which you attempted, yet flubbed so badly, M. I guess first we're going to Dijkstra. I leveled up. God, I'm stuck. Oh god, oh my god. I cannot walk through doors apparently. <laughs> that man's depressed as hell. I feel like I'm going the longest way that like I'm taking the longest way that I could possibly take to, to go there, you know what I mean? Walking around in circles and whatever. We're getting closer at least it seems. There's a lot of horses henchmen out. Look, like every single person is his henchman. They all never let your kind in, no grand proper. Hey. You didn't say nothing to me. Got a minute? I do. What do you want? Wiley. Horson Jr. He's working with Radovid. Huh? If this is reliable information, Horson's neck deep in shit. Well, I have a few letters. Source seems reliable. Hmm. 
It would certainly explain how he had the nerve to break with the Big Four. Need someone who can get me in to see Junior. You must still have some contacts among the Redanians? I don't, but you do. Enlighten me. Temerian, former commander of the Blue Stripes. Ring a bell? Vernon Roach. He's holed up with his men in a camp near Oxenford. Pay him a visit. You're sure to cheer him up at least. Okay then. And I will be doing that in the next episode. So today we did a few contracts and side quests, which is nice. We've completed a lot of them. Uh, in the next episode we'll check out a few notes boards, because it seems they have some new stuff on them. Possibly we'll go talk to Vern and Roach and whatever. Let Maybe do some side quests, we'll see. So I do hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please like and subscribe, comment down below, and consider following me on my social media somewhere on the screen or in the description below. I appreciate it a lot as well. We have a great rest of the week. Goodbye.